And you must have a, like a high level of trust for all of your team to say, great, let's do this. How do you instill that level of trust when you've got a team of, you know, 20 to staff? Yeah, look, uh, some of the team members are contracting team members. So we don't have a one set model that we will never get contractors or we'll never have, con you know, so we've got salary team at mortgage advisors and we've got contracting mortgage advisors because I believe one size doesn't fit. You got to be flexible um, in everything. You got to put yourself into the issues. And that's, I think, I feel in a little bit fortunate position that I've done this myself, you know, I used to collect documents, submit this application. I've done this for a good couple of years before, uh, you know, we have our first PA who can start collecting documents on your behalf. Or, uh, so I think you've got to be able to show the team hey, what's in it for them rather than what's in it for you. And, and just think of how you can help them grow their numbers because eventually they'll help you grow your numbers too. Um, so I always like to put myself into my my team members' shoes, from X, Y, and Z, what will I need to do to make sure A, he or she makes more money, B, what's their career progression look like? So, um, when we did the rebrand, um, one of my very first team member, he's a contractor to the business, Daniel, uh, he's more like a brother, so we gave him 10% shares in the business because at the end of the day, loyalty in this business is super, super important. It's actually the most powerful you know, strength in the business is how loyal the people are. And you've got to be able to just hold them really well by, A, are you paying them really well? Because if you're paying Aussie salaries in New Zealand, it's hard to leave. B, if they know that their vision and your vision lines together, it just makes a lot of sense to work together. So I'm very fortunate to have some really good loyal people and, and we just work together as a team. We hate hierarchy. You know, I hate the word staff and, and employees as I think I work for them rather than they work for me. Um.